Hi guys, Hyperlative here, the Norwegian gamer. Today I'm bringing you some gameplay with the Stoner 63. This is the uh, classified LMG, so you'll have to purchase the three other LMGs to be able to use this weapon. I am using it with the extended max, and this is actually my first gameplay with um, this weapon. This was the first match I used this weapon. And it was kind of strange actually because I also did really well. It just kind of clicked for me this round and I uh, went 19 and 3. And I know it's not a beastly score, but it's <laughs> it's a really good score for, uh, for me. So I'm just. I just thought it was awesome. Um, I wasn't aware that this weapon was that good, to be honest. So, well, what I really wanted to talk about was. Um, some players uh, that do stat padding and stat padding is kind of um, you're padding over your sta statistics so you're going out of your way to make your stats look good so what that usually means is that at least on consoles people search out lobbies with new players or noobs in them and play there to get good scores, to get high scores, to get high KD ratios and get go like 90 and 3 or something like that. So Holiday Doc had a recent video where he talked about this and stat padding and people doing things like this and he went on kind of a rant and I couldn't agree with him. I, I'm, I'm just He's just saying what what I want to, want to say. You know, these are people that search out lobbies just to get high KDRs. And I kind of compare them to the big bullies in the schoolyard. Because in, in every school, you've got that big bully that kind of beats up the small kids. You know, this is kind of a muscular guy. Or he might just be, let's call it, naturally big. And he always picks on the small guys. The ones that can't defend themselves. He never picks on the big guys, only the small ones. And that's what these people do too. They find the small guys slash noobs and just kick them around. Just for the heck of it really. And these are people that are new to the game and this player might just come in and ruin the whole experience for them. And really ruin an experience that should be fun and they might end up loving this game but they're this jerk that's coming here to just stat pad he he's ruined the whole experience and making it harder for the new player to f fall in love with this game and I I, I can't find a, find a better word for them than just jerks because that's what I think they are and I'm, I'm getting embarrassed by people that do that you know that's just embarrassing because if you're such a bad player that you need noobs to get good scores, you're not a good player. You're just a jerk. And nobody likes you. Not the ones that you pick on and not the guys that, sta that are standing on the sideline either. The only guys that think you're cool is the ones that are in your gang or your friends or your circle and you. Everyone else thinks you're a jerk, a dick, a prick, and all the other words that describe the same thing. I, I really can't put words on it, and Holiday Doc just said it so well that I, I found myself just sitting there nodding and going like, yeah, mm-hmm, yeah, and that's, that, it, it, it just put words in my mouth, I mean, uh, it was just, he said exactly what I want, want to say right now, but I can't because I'm not literate, uh, literate enough. <laughs> really, uh, Holiday ju just... Oh, he just said it right. So, I'll put a link in the description to his video, and I'll also put a link on the screen right now. So, click in the red box after you've seen this video, and please, just watch Holiday Doc's video, because it really puts... Word. He just says it. So that's it. I uh, hope to see you next time. Snuckers.